welcome to off the wall this is lavanya if you are new to my channel i am a type 1 diabetic dealing with it for 23 years successfully and happily this channel is about my type 1 diabetes lifestyle and how i am dealing with it today's episode is going to be about the drugs or the type 1 diabetes drugs and supplies that i use on a day to day basis to keep my sugars under control or uh, literally to help me survive it's been a really very very long time that i had posted videos on my channel because i had been really very busy with my personal stuff and a lot of things had been happening in my life so i just wanted to give a gap and today i am back with a new episode so let's begin <laughs> The first and foremost thing that I would like to show you is the insulin which is the primary part of my life without which I cannot survive. So uh, I use two types of insulin which is a meal time insulin another is a background insulin. So the meal time insulin is called insulin aspart or insulin fias. Uh, which is a really very very fast acting insulin which stays active for 4 hours uh, i uh, take this before my breakfast my lunch and my dinner and uh, sometimes before uh, having a high calorie snack or in between whenever necessary these are just cartridges that i uh, use it in my nova pen or uh, the pen it's called just the pen fill cartridge the second one is my background insulin that stays active for 24 hours uh, i uh, take this uh, in uh, the morning once in a day and um, stays active for 24 hours to keep my sugars under control to uh, prevent me from hyperglycemia i uh, use two types of pen with me one uh, is for my a uh, meal time insulin or my insulin fiasp and the second one uh, is for my uh, insulin treceba or my background acting insulin um yeah so um the cartridge can be refilled every now and then and the needles uh, also needs to be changed every time i uh, inject so that i stay hygienic and safe uh, i can just load my points like this and that's how it works and inject so this is how the pen works pen is by novo nordisk again and uh, the needle needs to be replaced every time you inject and i uh, buy a nano sized ultra fine needle uh, by bd and this looks like this you can uh, change this every time and stay hygienic remember that you do that every time so that you uh, do not infect yourself yeah so these are uh, the pri two primary or the foremost thing that i carry with me to places i go my uh, two types of insulin without which i do not go anywhere i and the second and foremost uh, thing that i would like to show you is my glucometer by vantage and uh, yep yeah, comes with test strips comes with test strips and a lancing pen yeah load it with the lancet prick yourself and test your blood sugar so uh, this is how the glucometer works lancet that i have a very very bad habit of not changing my lancets in my lancing pen 
yeah this needs to be changed every time but i do changes only whenever i uh, feel like changing or remember changing i uh, have a bag of it unopened and not good uh, probably i should just make it a practice to uh, change the lancet every now and then to help me stay hygienic yup the third thing is the uh, cgm machine that i carry with me uh, it's by uh, freestyle uh, libre as i had already spoken to you about in my lot of the videos i'm just giving you an emphasis on it because it just this just works through scan because you do not need to prick yourselves every now and then before your uh, meal or whenever necessary to adjust your insulin dosage uh, or calculate your amount of insulin based on the food you're going to have so this is the sensor that i wear that needs to be replaced every 14 days uh, the sensor pack looks like this this is an unopened pack because i'm just not going to open this now uh, it's a pretty new one probably i'll do another video whenever i do another inst whenever i do a new installation and uh, i would like to show you guys about it but right now i am just not going to open because this just looks like this this is the sensor that needs to be replaced every 14 days and i would like to show you uh, something very interesting which is the blood ketone test strips by uh, freestyle libre again uh, these are really really very costly i just use them only whenever necessary or in cases of emergency uh, you uh, can use this test strips in your freestyle libre reader itself you just need to install uh, i mean like insert the uh, strip here and feed in the blood and show the reading. Uh, fortunately, uh, my uh, ketone levels have never gone really very high or have been really very stable. And uh, probably just that I am keeping my sugars under control. I had never used insulin pump in my entire life or in my 23 years of my uh, experience of dealing with type 1 diabetes. I have been uh, really uh, surviving on um, my uh, Novo pins or the insulin pins only for uh, 23 years. Uh, and I am really doing very well and I have no complaints at all it's just that you have to uh, inject yourself multiple times that's the only disadvantage but then I uh, do really really feel very comfortable using insulin pens and it is affordable for me rather than the insulin pump because in India uh, the basic insulin pump model costs around an average average insulin pump uh, costs around one lakh rupees and is really very costly for me uh, thereby i uh, just go with insulin uh, pens which is affordable for me and i've been uh, pretty well managing uh, my uh, diabetes uh, well uh, the last time i uh, checked my uh, hba1c it was 6.4 I am really uh, happy with it. The doctor is really very happy with it, and uh, I am trying to improve my HbA1c uh, uh, in my upcoming days. Uh, the next okay. one is uh, about the Ensure Diabetes Care Powder that I use uh, every time, every day, almost every day before I go to bed. Uh, just to avoid hypoglycemia during uh, my early morning or whenever i wake up uh, sometimes i uh, end up with 50s or 40s whenever i wake up uh, and uh, which is uh, scary so my doctor uh, had asked me to take uh, this to help my uh, sugar stay under uh, control or to manage my blood sugars it has really proved me uh, uh, proved me well and has helped manage my blood sugars so this is a vanilla flavor uh, also comes in chocolate flavor i uh, uh, buy i sometimes buy chocolate i sometimes buy vanilla it depends on my uh, taste and my preference completely uh, this is my uh, multi vitamin strip 
that i uh, take on a day to day day to day basis just to keep me healthy and to keep me strong yep and yeah sanitizer this uh, is not doctor prescribed or anything just to clean my hands before i uh, check my blood sugars that's it so yeah this again i do carry with me all the time whenever i go out or it's always in my bag the last but not the least thing that i had not spoken to you guys about it in my videos yet uh i uh, was diagnosed with hashimoto's disease or hypothyroidism in 2012 and have been in treatment for so many years um it's not very uh, scary or uh, i uh, uh, i mean like i do not find any terrible or very bad incident because of hypothyroidism i uh, have been really uh, maintaining it or keeping my thyroids under control it's just that the treatment is really very simple uh, uh, just that i uh, consume uh, the pills in uh, my empty stomach or uh, early morning whenever i wake up uh, uh, just gulp in uh, the pill chug in a lot of water uh, uh, give a 20 minute gap and then have my breakfast so this is about uh, my hypothyroidism and have been dealing with it successfully so uh, nothing to worry about having a Hashimoto's disease or anything this is also um, probably you can say a consequence of a type 1 diabetes of 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 having type 1 diabetes because type 1 diabetes is an autoimmune disorder that usually affects other organs and uh, thyroid is one such organ um, which gets which gets affected by it so, so this is about it so uh, hope you guys enjoyed or you guys were able to connect with it for those who are type 1 diabetic and if you have anything to say please drop in your comments and i would really love to uh, read them and uh, uh, listen to your advice as well yep so uh, i'll uh, catch you up in another episode until then stay tuned uh, and don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. See you. Bye-bye.